Yahweh, Allah, Yahweh, by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, by Hashem, Rakaku Dash. That's who this word only calls God and Jesus Christ. It's Paleo Hebrew Tongues, Brother Anathan Yah, back with a quick hit. I uh, want to give a double honors to the elders, Apostle Great Millstone, who will teach well, raising up Tabernacles of David, seeking out the elect in the last days. <clears throat> and uh, shout out to the elder, Minna Israel, Brother Kazak, whom I teach us, and Shalom to the whole four elect. And a few aqua out there watching, believe. Um, let me just get straight into it, man. Came across this man. The, uh, I was on the game, playing the game with the elder last night, and um, he uh, he had quoted this scripture, and um, uh, this made me want to go into it, man. You know, uh, probably just the first first uh, four scriptures, um, because uh, we live in a world where uh, you know atheism and the the disbelief and in infidelity is at an all time high man you know and infidelity will be cut off soon because the Yahweh by Shimei will be you know he'll be he'll, he's coming back you know and everyone every eye shall see him you know every everybody that thought there wasn't a power a higher power or a god will uh will see that there is a, a a god man that's the god of Abraham Isaac and Jacob man the only god you know this is Psalms 14 it says the fool has said in his heart there is no God. <clears throat> they are corrupt. They have done abominable works. There is none that doeth good. You see? You see, the Lord said there is none that doeth good, man. You know? He said, he said, Yahweh by Shem, Yahweh Shai, looked down from heaven upon the children of men to see if there were any that did understand and seek Yahweh. They are all gone aside, and they are all together become filthy. There is none that doeth good, no, not one. You know, and this is this is this is what the uh, elder. This is the precept uh, that the elder had uh, had quoted. Verses it was verse three he said, "There is none that doeth good, no, not one, that the heavenly Father have not seen when he looked uh, looked down upon the earth, man. You know, from the heavens." So, like, let me get a sip of water. He said, um, "You know, there was uh, there wasn't any that did good or that did understand and seek you out, man." You know, because the heathens and uh, our people, they don't, they don't know the, they don't know the how about Shimei Shai, man. They don't know his judgments. They don't know what he, you know, who his name, you know, what what type of personality, what type of manner of of a power he is. You know, they all think that uh, they they believe in good old JC, man. They believe in good old J Jesus Christ, and that he's just a all loving God and all forgiving God. Yeah, he's forgiven to our people, but. You know, we still have to be punished for our doings and for our sayings, man. You know, we still have to pay for our, our iniquity, man. You know, the, the scriptures say that, uh, you know, he will start at the house of Israel first when it comes to uh, bringing judgment, man. You know, it says, um, uh, have all the workers of iniquity no knowledge who eat up my people as they eat bread and, and call not upon you. How about Shimei You see, so all, all the workers of iniquity. You know, we we're out here giving this knowledge, wisdom, and understanding of the scriptures to 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 people that aren't that aren't hip to it. You know, to people out we see on the highways and byways, man. You know, and there you got all our people, and, and all our people are calling upon all these different gods, man. You know, they're not seeking Yahweh by Shem Shah. They're actually not reading the Bible for themselves, trying to figure out. You know. Uh, what's you know what what what's what's the meaning of all this in the state uh, uh, of this world? We got all this sin and iniquity and wickedness in this world, and people don't even consider why, you know. And that shit that that's a problem, you know. And people that don't consider why, they mean what? They're comfortable in Babylon, you know. They're comfortable living according to the flesh and not the spirit, not receiving the spirit. What they think is the spirit, you know. That, Cause they 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 uh, these Christians in these churches, they uh their perception of the spirit is hooping and hollering and running up and down in church looking like a damn fool man. You look like a damn demon, like you possessed by something man. And they jumping up and down and fainting and passing out and running. Some of them be doing jumping jack exercises in the church and doing all that extra stuff man. You know that's not the Holy Spirit man. You know. Holy Spirit is wisdom, knowledge, and understanding of these scriptures, man. You know what he said? They, they said they're all going aside. They're all together become filthy. There is none that do it good. No, not one. Like he said, my people have no uh, uh, have knowledge to do evil. 
You know what I'm saying? Knowledge. To do. Let me see. Yeah, Jeremiah 4 and 22, it says, For my people is foolish, they have not known me. See, like he said, they see, he, he looked down to see if the, if any understanding did seek him. You know, how how, how can you how can you get to know the, the how about Shimei was shot? By seeking him through these scriptures, studying, you know, look at, uh, getting to know these scriptures, these parables, you know, and, 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 and hearkening to the prophets, you know. It says, they have not known me, they are sodish children, meaning they are stupid. They have they have none understanding. You see, you see. He said he looked down to see if there was any that did understand and did seek Yahweh. He's telling you they they, they don't know him. He said my people don't know him and they have none understanding. He said they are wise to do evil, but to do good they have no knowledge. You see, he said I beheld the earth and lo, it was without form and void in the heavens and they had no light. Well, nah, the, the point is verse twenty two. You know, sometimes I, I have a habit of keep reading, but. You can go back and uh, you know, read the full chapter for for if you want to, if you have you know, you want a better uh, understanding in context, you know. But this is talking about Israel right here, man, in, in Jeremiah uh, verse four and twenty two. You know, it's talking about Israel. He said they they have none understanding. They are wise to do evil, but to do good they have no knowledge. You see, that's why the Lord said He looked looked down upon the earth and He see none that do of good uh, of His people, man. <clears throat> You see, and like I said earlier, like there, you have our, our people are living only according to their uh, to their 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 flesh and their spirit and what they deem to be right. You know, what they deem to be right. You know, and uh, matter of fact, let me get Romans ten. Uh, so I can what is it? You know? Yes, uh, Romans 10, brethren, my heart desire and prayer to Yahweh for Israel is that they might be saved, you know, for I bear them record that they have a zeal of Yahweh, and this is these Christians, they have a zeal of, of praising who they think is the Lord and who is the Heavenly Father, who is the, all, the, the, the Almighty Power, you know, yeah, uh, they, they have a zeal of that. But not according to knowledge, meaning they don't they're, they're not serving the right God. They don't have the knowledge, and wisdom, understanding to discern who or what they uh, are, are, are on praying and praising. You know. Dang, what's that scripture where it says, uh, um, uh, you, you know, not what, what you worship, but salvation of the, of the Jews. I forgot what, what, what that is. What, what 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 scripture that is, but um, it'll come to me. But yeah, man, they don't. Like I said they don't. These Christians, and I'm mainly talking about our people. F fuck these Edomites, you know. Forget the heathens, you know, that are Christians. I'm talking about you, so-called Negroes, Hispanics, and Native Indians, man. That 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 are are, are that fell fall victim to these religions, you know, to 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 Christianity, uh, Islam, and Nation of Islam, and all these other. Uh, uh, folly doctrines, you know, outside of the scriptures, man. It says, for they being ignorant of Yahweh's righteousness, Yahweh by Shimei was Shai's righteousness, and going about to establish their own righteousness. You see, have not submitted themselves unto the righteousness of Yahweh by Shimei was You know, and, and, and this is this is the problem. People are so comfortable. That they don't even consider uh, why the world is in this state. They're so comfortable in, in their own righteousness and not Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shai's righteousness, you know, submitting to themselves and to their flesh and to their mind, that they don't even consider the Lord's mind, man. How does the Lord think about this thing, these things? How does the how does the how does the, the Heavenly Father and the Son think about this world? You know, how do they think about uh, 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 the wickedness that goes on in this world. Why is it, you know, why is it, why is it, why is it like this? You know, they don't consider these things. And then you gotta, you gotta, you, you can't stop there because you gotta fault the pastors too. They don't have no leaders. These pastors are, are, are just as worse because they're the ones leading, uh, Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah's flock astray, man. 
And that's why that's why uh, in uh, Jeremiah chapter 23, the Lord uh, uh, it tells you that, hey, these, these pastors that lead my flock astray will not go unpunished either. You know, and you're seeing a lot on end time uh, end time headlines. If you don't have that app, download it, man, because uh, you see a lot of uh, a lot of articles about hey, pastors are getting judged. You know, pastors are getting exposed throughout the nation of, uh, of Babylon, man. AKA, you know, America, you know, these pastors are getting judged, man, you know, because what they establish their own righteousness, you know, they're not, they're not teaching the, 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 the scriptures properly, man. And what, and the result of that going on for hundreds and hundreds of years, uh, 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 uh our people fall into these false doctrines. What do you get? You get people that's comfortable in, in their own flesh serving themselves man and not Yahweh by Shem Shah according to knowledge and not in righteousness and not in not in truth you know not in truth and, and, and hey man <laughs> y'all are gonna see very soon what, what the heavenly father is gonna do you all that think that think you are serving the right right uh power man Thinking you're you're being a righteous person, you you're not so you're not doing no righteousness at all, at all. Y'all will see very soon, man. But um, that that's it for this little quick hit. Hopefully, that was edifying. Until next time, shalom.